Hi guys you're watching Forutech and today we are going to review the new ROM bootlegger's ROM for OnePlus One. This is one of the most customizable ROM after Resurrection Remix. It's having the lots of customization and it's a stable ROM. So let's get started. First you have to download the bootleggers rom and open gapps 8.1 from the link given onto our video description then boot your phone into the recovery mode. You need the latest TWRP recovery 3.2.1 then wipe your data, cache and Dalvik. After completing the wiping process you have to flash the rom and the gapps. See this, I am flashing the bootleggers rom and the gapps after the flashing of the rom. You have to click on the reboot system. After rebooting you will see the nice logo for bootleggers ROM. Then the ROM will boots into the initial setup. You have to complete that setup and then you enter into the customizations home. This is the launcher available for bootleggers ROM. This launcher is similar to the pixel launcher having all the features including round icons, quick notification dots etc. This ROM is comes with the new gallery app called as camera roll app. It looks nice. It also gets bootleggers wallpaper app and it's also good when you goes into the system you see that the ROM comes with the Android Oreo 8.1.0 latest security patch for 5th July 2018 into the settings under the bootleg dumpster you get the lost of customization option in which the first one is the status bar in status bar we can able to set the different boot logos and different options are also available in quick settings you get the quick pull down smart pull down and lots of customizations are available one of the main feature is custom header image in that you can set the different custom header images for your quick setting panel see this, these are the some examples of quick settings uh, custom header images you can change the different quick setting tiles all the quick setting tiles are accessible through quick setting panel you get the lost of quick setting tiles under hardware button customizations you can able to change the different aspects of your hardware buttons like power buttons hardware keys the how the hardware keys will be aware on the simple tap on the long press action double tap action you can add the different actions then you get the navigation bar features here you also get uh, the navigation stock navigation bar you get the flink you get the smart bar these all the features are available in this rom see this this is the fling this is the smart bar and this is the stock one the most important customization is under the lock screen where you get the different types of widgets clock widgets you can change the fonts of the lock screen items you can change the left uh, shortcuts right shortcuts see this i have changed some aspects of the lock screen options and they looks very nice see this when i when i locks my phone all the customizations will appear on my lock screen it's a new style of fonts new lock uh, new clock when i change it to analog clock it's look very nice you can able to change the left one shortcut you can able to change right shortcut see this bunch of options are available to add the shortcuts for left and right key and you also get the next customization option is the recents and it comes with the android go recent style the grid type of recent style and the stock one this is the android go recent style then the next one is the grid and all the recent style customizations looks very nice then you get the power button customizations where you can add the bunch of option into your power menu see these these are the all the customizations for power menu the next customization option is under the animations 
the chrome comes with the lots of animations for the list view list to interpolar can also be changed then the you get the systems animations you get the lost stop animation the rom comes with the android p type of system animation so this this is the list view animation we have type of list view, view animation these are the quick setting tiles animations which looks very nice then uh, this one is the android p system animations overall system animation get changed to android p see this these are the android p style of system animation then you get the carbon gestures which is the new one where you can able to set two finger gestures for right corner left corner from bottom right and the left corner set it as per your requirement then you also get the stock gestures under the miscellaneous option there are bunch of options are available under the display you get the all the theming style for this rom where you can able to change the ascent color you can able to change the themes for your rom under the us style this rom comes with its own illusions ui different styles of user interface can be changed with the using of this theming option which looks nice and is a rom specific option uh, available for this rom the display option you get the expanded desktop option for all the apps you get the screen saver ambient display for new notification in case of camera the camera clarity is good uh, see this these are some examples the camera comes with all the features of the stock camera and uh, it looks very performance of this rom is very good there is no no lag anywhere and it looks uh, daily driver rom there is no bug still now so guys like this video subscribe this channel we give lots of give videos like this so thank you for watching